We're here doing a live stream. We just got some breaking news here from Nikon rumors about the Nikon Z8. It's kind of feeding some more speculation. There's been a, a lot of different back and forth about this camera. Now, the original leaks and rumors that were coming from um, How to Fly, he was kind of halfway credited, halfway discredited, but uh, Nikon Rumors was not going with his speculation. He was saying that it's going to have the same 45 megapixel stack sensor as the Nikon Z9, which would have been nuts as it is, but this is uh, feeding some new information here because it says Nikon, or, uh, Nikon China released an image uh, with a Z from a 67 uh, megapixel photo on social media. So down here it says Nikon posted four images on their we uh, Weibo social media channel and caused a lot of speculation because one of the photos has a resolution of uh, 6,670 by 10,000 or around 67 megapixels. So that's crazy. Um, you can download the original file here I'm trusting that they did it, and I don't really want to do that live streaming right now. Uh, but you can see here. So there's two options, um, or I guess three technically, but one of them it looks like it's being eliminated or somewhat eliminated. It says Nikon currently does not have a 67 megapixel sensor. Neither does anybody else, to my knowledge. Uh, we have some medium format sensors, maybe, possibly, that are uh, different cameras. I know we have a 100 megapixel uh, medium format, but we don't have any other full frame. Sony's the highest one at 61 megapixels. Of course, the picture could be upscaled or taken from another camera. Uh, a reverse image search of the photo did not return any results, which reduces the possibility of Nikon China using a stock photo. So it could be upscaled here. That's a, that's a possibility. Um, but if you're, I mean, is this being released on their social media? Like, why would you upscale to 67 megapixels for a, I don't know, for a web, uh, to me that that's like excessive. Who's, who's looking at this? I mean, I know you want these little bitty details and stuff like that, but if you're posting it on social media, why are you going to upscale that to 67 megapixels? Especially if you have the Nikon Z9, what's 50, what, you 45 megapixels isn't going to give you enough detail for an online image. I mean, you're not printing this like the size of anything else. Ooh, this is big. So I think that would be, let me know in the, the, the comments below. Um, do you think this is coming from the Nikon Z8? Uh, do you think we're making too much out of this? Uh, or do you think this is actually a thing? Or is it possible that the Nikon uh, Z7 Mark III is going to have this and it's not going to be the Z8? So that that's interesting. I think that it makes sense that it would be a Z8 because I just think uh, from a marketing perspective, that would be great. But I do not know the Nikon Z8 is supposed to be kind of a, um, I guess, a spiritual successor to uh, the 850. So I just I just wonder how that usually works out. Does it usually keep with the same sensor of the Nikon Z9 or is it usually something different? It'd be great to hear if this is going to be a thing because also the Sony a7R5 is supposed to be coming out somewhere around October. It's been rumored for a long time and people are wondering... Are they going to change the megapixel sensor size? Are they going to stick with the 61 megapixels that they already have in it? I, I kind of go back and forth, but sometimes I lean that they could stick with the same sensor size because no one's topped it yet. And they could just improve the ergonomics, processing, make it a little faster, and uh, maybe even add some higher end video with it. Um, you have some 8K even if you wanted to. I know video's not necessarily, it's not that kind of camera, but still you could have 8K in it at this point. Um, and you could just update a lot of the, uh, you know, quality of life type things uh, with the same sensor. But then the, on the flip side, some people are saying it has a 90 plus megapixel sensor. So if Nikon's about to come out with a Z8 or a different camera with a 67 megapixel sensor, uh, what does that mean? Does that mean that Sony's trying to up it? Um, usually Sony makes their sensors, so it seems like they would know if uh, they were making or commissioning a 67 megapixel sensor for Nikon. Wow, I'm pretty excited about this. Uh, drop in the comment section below, let me know, or drop in the chat here, because we're live streaming, but I, I want to clip this part out because this is big news. Oh, wow, I'm excited about this.